Hello, I wish to make a complaint. Hello, miss? <laughs> what? <clears throat> Sorry, I have a delirium. I beg your pardon. Yeah, what do you want, boy? Well, I wish to make a complaint about this mongoose. So, what's wrong with it? I'll tell you what's wrong with it. It's a lemon, that's what's wrong with it. No, it's idling. Idling? I had to push this blasted contraption all the way over here. The battery's not charged. No, it's not just the battery. The whole thing doesn't work. Maybe you forgot to put gas in it. No. I always put gas in it before I even leave the house. This, sir, is a dead mongoose. No, no, it's resting. Resting? Yes, resting. Wonderful bird it is. Lovely plumage. What? Oh, sorry, wrong line. I mean, it's just idling very quietly. Well, if it's only idling, I'll just go ahead and get her wrapped up then. If that's not enough... Hello, Mongoose! Wake up! I've got a nice oil can for you if you wake up! Now that's what I call a dead Mongoose! No, 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 no. It's idling. Wonderful model. Lovely plumbing. Stop saying that! There she goes. No, it's not. You just hit it. I never. Yes, you did. I never hit anything. Yes, you did. Did not. Hello, Mongoose. Testing, testing, testing. This is your nine o'clock alarm. Wake up. Why did you say that? I... I don't know. It felt like something came over me. Something... silly. It's stunned. <laughs> what? Yeah, just as I was about to get itself in gear, you banged the vehicle, stunning the thing! Now look, mate, I've definitely had enough of this. That mongoose is definitely dead, and when I punched it not a half an hour ago, you assured me that its total lack of startup was due to it being tired and shagged out. Well, he's... he's, uh, probably pining for the Ford's dealership. Pining for the Ford's dealership? What kind of talk is that? Look! Why did it break down the moment I got the mongoose home? It's recommended that the mongoose must be on its back to circulate the oil. Look, I took the liberty of examining that vehicle when I got it home, and I discovered the only reason that it sounded like it was working in the first place was because it had a tape recorder playing a loop with the sounds of a proper mongoose running nailed to the steering wheel. And I noticed that your shop is conveniently located at the highest point in town. Well, of course, it was nailed there. If I hadn't nailed the tape recorder to the steering wheel, it would have nozzled up to those bars, causing them to bend apart with its tires and zoom! Zoom? Sir, this vehicle wouldn't zoom, or zoom, 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 for that matter, if you put four million volts through it! It's bleeding devised! No, no, it's pining! It's not pining! He's passed on! This mongoose is no more! He has ceased to be anything other than a bucket of rust! He's expired and gone to meet his maker! Literally! He's a stiff, bereft of life! He rests in peace! That tape recorder is the only thing that does work on it! It's pushing up the daisies! His metabolic processes are now history! He's off the twig! He's kicked the bucket! He's shuffled off his model coil, run down the curtain and joined the bleeding choir invisible! This is an ex-mongoose! Well, I better replace it then. <laughs> Sorry, I've had a look around the back of the shop and uh, we're out of mongoose. Is that the correct plural form of the singular mongoose? Um, let's see. Mongooses? That doesn't sound right. How about mongai? Nope. Mongais. Uh-uh. Mongooses? Bingo! That's the one! Right, right. Now, as I was saying, we're fresh out of mongooses. I see. I see. I get the picture. I've got a slug. Pray, can you ride it? 
Not really. Well, it's hardly a bloody replacement, isn't it? No, I guess not. Hmm. Tell you what, if you go to my brother's repair shop in Piston, he'll replace it for you. Piston, huh? Yeah. All right. City rail for you. I wish to make a complaint. I don't have to do this, you know. Pardon? I'm a qualified brain surgeon, you know. I only do this because I like being my own boss. Excuse me? This is irrelevant, isn't it? Oh yeah, well, the script did take a long time to make. Yeah, this was rewritten many times. Aren't you supposed to be behind the camera? Oh. Um, uh, bye. Leave it to fish on a bicycle. Huh. Yeah, yeah. Well, I wish to complain. I got on the piston train and found myself deposited here in Dipswitch. No, this is piston. The repair shop owner's brother is lying. Well, you can't blame Halo Reach Rails for that. If this is piston, I shall return to the repair shop. I understand this is piston. Yeah. But you told me it was dip switch. It was a pun. A pun? No, no, not a pun. What's the other thing where it reads the same backwards as forwards? A palindrome? Yeah, yeah. It's not a palindrome. The palindrome of Piston would be not sip. Not sip what? Not sip. Not sip what? Not sip. Not sip what? Not sip! What don't you want me to sip? No! The palindrome of Piston is not sip! Well, of course sip would not be the palindrome of Piston! No, no, no! Calm down, Percival. You knew what you were signing up for. The word Piston, when reversed, would spell out N-O-T-S-I-P, otherwise pronounced as not sip. Oh... This is getting silly, isn't it? Yes, right! This shot is getting too ridiculous! I insist that the audience just move along to another YouTube video! Who, Who are, are you? you? I am the voice of reason in a world of silliness! I said move, dirtbag! Go! Do something with your life! Do some jumping jacks! Eat a carrot! That's a bit much, don't you think? You shut your silly mouth! I see you sitting there, you rotund, quivering mound of flesh! Move your bodacious candy bottom! That definitely is going too far! Look, I'll tell you what I told the PTA. They'll be better for it! None of that TLC nonsensical rubbish! It'll motivate them! They'll get their rears in gear, drop the Twinkies, hit the books, get a degree, become an architect, build a bridge, and they'll bloody well get over it!